Welcome to the Psychology Unit 2 section of the Final Exam Study Guide. I will walk you through the questions for Unit 2. Number 26, what is consciousness? Consciousness is the awareness of ourselves and our surroundings. There are three levels to be conscious, subconscious, and unconscious. 27. What is a common test to uncover what is inside a person's consciousness? The priming test. Priming test. 28. What are the three levels of consciousness? Conscious, subconscious, unconscious. 29. What does REM stand for? Rapid Eye Movement. Rapid Eye Movement. I'll say that again in case you didn't hear the bell. Rapid eye movement. 30. What is the deepest stage of REM sleep? Delta or stage 4 delta sleep. Delta is okay to say on the test. 31. According to Sigmund Freud, what is the purpose of dreams? It is to uncover our unconscious thoughts. 32. What is narcolepsy? A sleep disorder where a person falls directly into REM sleep. 33. What is sleep apnea? A sleep disorder where a person stops breathing when asleep. 34. What is sonambulism? It is a sleep condition where someone sleepwalks. 35. What is the difference between a nightmare and a night terror? A nightmare is a really bad dream. A night terror is a really bad dream that is accompanied or joined by physiological conditions such as rapid heart rate and could lead to a heart attack. 36. What is insomnia? Insomnia is a sleep condition where someone has the inability to get sleep and they can't fall asleep. 37. How can hypnosis be defined? Hypnosis is a social interaction between two people. 38. What is the key to success with hypnosis? Hypnosis, the key to success, is the power of suggestion. 39. What is the difference between a stimulant and a depressant? A stimulant is a psychoactive drug that increases the central nervous system. A depressant is a psychoactive drug that slows the central nervous system. 40. One example of a stimulant would be caffeine. 41. One example of a depressant would be alcohol. 42. What is tolerance? Tolerance is when someone develops an um, expectation of what the effects of a psycho drug, psychoactive drug have on you. And so you um, get used to the effect of the change of consciousness over time, and so you become tolerant or open to um, a certain level of dosage of a psychoactive drug. So somebody who has developed a tolerance for caffeine through drinking coffee will become um, not unaffected by the usual dose of two cups a day, and it will not have any effect on them anymore as much as it used to have. 43. What is withdrawal? Withdrawal is when somebody has a negative effect or a negative experience after not having their usual tolerant dosage of a drug. So with tolerance, if you have built up a tolerance of two cups of caffeine through coffee a day and you don't have two cups, then you will have a headache and go through what's called withdrawal. That completes the Unit 2 section of the Psychology Final Exam Study Guide. Please see the Unit 3 video for that review.